Let me set the scenario. I'm going to start by making my face notch. I'm going to make the bottom cut parallel to the ground, and then I'm going to make my top cut here perpendicular to the limb. This should give me just about the right amount of face notch opening so that when the limb lifts up, the hinge will break. Now, once I've made the face notch, I'm going to have the guys on the ground tension up the lowering line, get some tension in it. And then I'll come in and make my back cut from the underside of the limb, leaving a nice working hinge. Once I've done that, I'll be able to swing out of the way, and the guys will be able to lift the limb up, and we'll have a nice controlled lowering situation. All right, let's see how it's going to go. OK, guys, you ready on the lowering line? You've got a couple wraps on the porter wrap. I'm going to start with a face notch, and then I'll have you guys take up a little tension. Okay, stand clear. Okay, guys, let's tension up the line. Okay, now that we've finished our face notch, I've cut out the little curve cut so that in case we get some fiber tear at the end of the hinge, it will break away. The guys have taken up some tension on the line. Now I'm going to make my back cut on the underside, get a nice hinge, and then I'll be able to get out of the way and we'll lift her up. Stand clear. Cutting it off. Notice how Rip uses the bar of the saw to line up his back cut with the apex of the face knife. As he cuts his back cut, he's very careful not to cut through the hinge, leaving enough holding wood to lift the piece in a controlled manner. All right, guys, I'm out of here. Lift her up. A functional hinge is important to this technique. Therefore, this technique may not be effective on dead or decayed limbs. Nice and easy. Beautiful job, gentlemen. Beautiful job. OK. Notice the nice control we had there in the rigging situation. There wasn't a lot of swing. We were able to get the, the, the face notch just right, so the, the, hin, the piece hinged right up, and then the hinge broke off. Now the guys are removing the fiddle blocks from the lowering line, and then they'll be able to lower the piece down safely. Excellent job.